Lila Cockrell's passing especially hard for another influential San Antonio mayor, Henry Cisneros, had known her since back when he was still a city hall intern and she was on city council. He sat down with our Jesse DeGoyado to reflect on Lila Cockrell's life in public service and just what it taught him. Former San Antonio mayor Henry Cisneros says other than his late parents. This woman touched me uh, deeply more than anybody else I can think of. Representing District 1 in the mid-70s, Henry Cisneros sat to the right of his mentor, Mayor Lila Cockrell. I mean, she made men respect women. She made women proud that there was a woman in the job. Cisneros says Lila Cockrell made the most of what he called her old world qualities. Courtesy, dignity, ladylike demeanor, manners. While still blazing a trail for other women. I just watched, listened, saw how she found consensus out of situations where there was no consensus. Yet always remaining optimistic, a solution could be found. Those are lessons I've been able to act on the rest of my life. Along with her respect for the city, its people, and diversity. Celebrate them, raise them up, don't tear them down, don't denigrate people. Cisneros wrote the foreword to her book. Its title reflects how Lila Cockrell felt about her beloved city. It was a love affair both ways. The people of San Antonio also loved her. Cisneros says he'd just seen her less than two weeks ago. I expected to see her frail and sad, and she was upbeat and bright-eyed and wanting to talk. That's just Lila. That's just Lila. Uh, excuse me. And um, I, I held her hand. She squeezed my hand, and she said, uh, you're one of my favorites. <laughs> to hear more of Henry Cisnettles' interview, we have all of it posted on our website, kset.com. Difficult though it may be, Cisnettles says he's been asked to deliver her eulogy. In honor of Cockrell, Mayor Ron Nirenberg has said that flags throughout the city will be flying at half staff until after her funeral services. Those arrangements are still pending. Live downtown, Jesse Degollado, KSAT 12 News.